Okay, Magda, here's a short video that shows you how to download and print emails, sorry, attachments to emails. I'm going to do this for two different kinds of attachments. Most of your attachments will be PDF files, portable document format files, and they'll look like this. This is a simple PDF file. Some of the other ones, you can't see this, but some of the other ones there, it appears on the screen. This is a test. Some of your other attachments will be docx files. There may be others, but those will be the, the two primary kinds. I've sent myself these two messages. And the first step in both cases is to download the file from the message to your computer. To do that, you click anywhere in one of these boxes. Let's do the, the PDF one first. So click anywhere except in here. Don't click in this box. Click out here. Click over here. It doesn't matter. I'm going to click here. When I do that, the message opens up and I can see the message. This was really simple. I just said PDF test. And here is the attachment. And what you want to do next is click on this down arrow that says download. And when you do that, it will make a copy of this file and put it on the computer you're using, your computer at home or the computer at the senior center. So I'm going to do that now. And it says over here, what do I want to do with this file? I want to save it to my computer. So I click on OK. And it's saved to my computer. Um, now we have to go find it. And to do that, I'm going to open another program here and make it so you can see it. And that file would have been saved to my downloads folder. So you go into Quick Access. If the little triangle is pointed to the right, click on the little triangle so that it points down so that you can see downloads. When I click on downloads, it's not there. Where did it go? Oh, there it is. Um, I had them sorted in a different way. So now it's right there. And that is the file that was attached to that email. This is a test.pdf. Once you've found the file, in, again, in our Downloads folder, double-click on it. And you can't see this either. So there is the, the file. It's Again, it's a really simple example. But it's a PDF file, a portable document format file, and Adobe Acrobat Reader should open automatically. In Adobe Acrobat Reader, there's a Print button. And when you click on the Print button, you'll see something that looks like this. Um, at the Senior Center, you have a different printer than I do here. So you click on this list, you find the printer in this list. Our printer at the Senior Center is a Samsung 2070. So you click on that printer in this list. Uh, again, I can't show you that because I'm at home and I don't have that printer. But once you've found the Samsung printer and clicked on it and you've displayed Samsung 2070 up here, click on Print, you're done the document should come out of the printer. That's all there is to it. So we did two things there. We downloaded the file from the email into your downloads folder and then we printed it. Um, I'm going to do it again. We're going to go back to my inbox and we're going to do it for the docx file. Again, we don't click in this area. We click out here, over here. I'm going to click over here and here is the here is the file just like with the PDF file we we hover here we don't click yet but we hover and that makes this down arrow appear and we click on that button the download and that downloads it from Google to the computer you're working on and it says what would you like me to do I want to save this file so you click on save if it's not already as there and then you click on OK and it'll be saved in our downloads folder. So again, we go to our downloads folder. Oops, and I slide it back up so you can see it. And now we have, this is a test.docx. So this is the file that we just downloaded. I'm going to double click on that. And this happens. Now you can't see this. So again, I'll just scooch it in here so you can see it in this window. This is the, the file we just downloaded. Again, a really simple example. Uh, we have to do a thing up here which says enable editing because if you don't do, oh, hang on, maybe we can print this. We don't have to do that. I'm sorry, but we can print it. So 
in the upper left hand corner you see here's a file uh, tab you click on the file tab and this appears and then you click on the print item and when you do that this appears oh we have to click on enable printing okay so we're going to click on enable printing and again we have to select a printer in this box at the senior center you're looking for the m sorry samsung 2070 printer so you click on this list you find the samsung printer in this list you click on it again i'm quickly clicking on my printer not your samsung printer but once you have samsung in this box you click on print you're done so that's how to download and print two kinds of attachments that you'll see in your emails docx files and pdf files um, We'll go over this in detail on Wednesday when I see you. I hope this video helps.